So what's the big deal about Tableau Pulse? How is it different from other solutions and innovations in the data analytics space? And how will it impact your business users? I'm hoping that uh, today's short video will answer those questions. And to set up the background, understand that less than 30% of business users are using data to make their decisions. We've so often failed to get meaningful, relevant insights into the hands of non-analyst business users. And I believe that Pulse will really make a big difference and help us to turn that around. And to give you an introduction, imagine a world where you receive a digest, a daily or a weekly or a data-driven alert digest about the metrics you care about. You're able to explore details to understand what's happening very quickly and easily get to the why without diving into a complex dashboard or dashboards, just in the flow of work, investigating, understanding uh, your, your data and what's going on in your organization. Ask follow-up questions using natural human language and then share those insights with your team. Collaborate and make data-driven decisions. So for the story today, we're going to meet the Acme customer experience team that covers customer service, case management, and cross-selling and upselling. We have Sue, who is the CX coach. She manages a team of customer experience agents. And then we have her manager, Ashley, who is the head of CX for Acme. Sue is at the office, she's chatting with a colleague, and she receives an alert on her phone. As she brings up her phone and looks at the alert, she is brought into Tableau Pulse. And she can see immediately from the red unusual in the top right, that something's going on in the organization that she needs to know about. And by the way, understand that she has not gone looking for insights, rather insights have found her. There's been a very significant and unusual increase in bot cases uh, around where is my order. We can see that it's plus 27% compared to the previous period. We've got a nice simple line chart that shows that increase uh, over time. And so Sue makes a decision that she needs to understand this better and then communicate this to her manager, Ashley. She goes to her laptop and brings up Tableau Pulse. Now, Sue follows 12 metrics within Pulse that are of interest to her. And she can see that one of those is unusual and 11 are normal. The one that's unusual is the one that was brought up on her phone. Um, so she's going to dive into that. She clicks on the tile. And now she can see a little bit more detail, but more importantly, Sue has the opportunity to ask questions of her data. She didn't get click on a link and get brought into complex dashboards and then have to slice and dice and drill into them. Sue is not very confident at doing that. And also Sue has very little time. And so she just wants to quickly drill into the data as simply as possible and then share the insights with her manager, Ashley. She has two suggested questions here. So she clicks on one of those, which is what is driving the spike in bot cases? Now Tableau has come back with a natural language summary for her and a very simple bar chart to visualize a comparison of key drivers. Sue can see that the main factor driving that spike in bot cases is supply chain. And in fact, that issue dwarfs the other two issues. And that's a very important insight for Sue because now she can get to the bottom of what's going on, why it's happening, and her and Ashley can put their heads together um, to um, take action on this insight. So now what Sue does is she clicks on the share button to share this with uh, Ashley in Slack. Now in the future, customers will be able to do this via Teams. It can also currently be done via Tableau and through email. But in Slack here, uh, there's a pre-configured uh, alert uh, and um, uh, sharing window that shows the information that's going to be sent to Ashley. Sue clicks on share. And that information is instantly sent to Ashley, the head of CX. 
Now, Ashley's working from home. She's sitting at her laptop and she gets a notification from Slack. She clicks on that notification and that brings her into this window. And she can see that Sue has shared a Tableau Pulse Insight with her. Very quickly, in just a few seconds, uh, Ashley is able to understand what's happening regarding those spike in bot cases. She has a simple chart to understand that further. She then drills in and clicks on top contributors and can see that, again, supply chain by far is the primary factor that is driving the spike in bot um, cases around where is my order. Now, should um, Ashley so choose, she could click on uh, this question, what impact will this have? Or she can jump into Pulse herself and just ask simple questions of the data using natural language. But in this case, she doesn't need to do that. All of the information that Ashley needs to get with her team leaders, understand more about what's going on, and then put a strategy in place to uh, turn this around has been brought to her attention through Tableau Pulse. And again, neither Ashley nor Sue went looking for insights. Insights found them. They didn't have to log into Tableau Cloud, uh, drill into um, complex dashboards, slice and dice the data. They do have the option to do that if they really want to get into a uh, more granular, deep dive analysis. Uh, they could work with one of their data analysts to do so, for example. But Pulse has really transformed the consumption and the actioning of uh, relevant data insights for these non-analyst business personas. And that's where Pulse is going to change everything.